Different celebrities follow different religions. While it may be evident to tell which celebrities belong to which faith at times, in some cases, it can be a surprise to discover their religion. Most people know about superstars like Gal Gadot and Barbara Streisand, they're Jewish, but many other celebrities are Jewish too, and you probably never knew. Welcome back guys to another FTD Facts episode. My name is Leroy Kenton, and today I'll be looking at 10 celebrities who are surprisingly Jewish. So let's get started and uncover some facts about some of your favorite celebrities out there. Coming in at number 10, we have the superstar rapper Drake. He was raised Jewish thanks to his mom. Drake's mom descends from Lithuanian and Russian Jews. Now, his dad is a black musician from the United States. His parents had gotten divorced when he was just five years old and he moved with his mom to live with his maternal uncle. From there, he grew up in an affluent Jewish neighborhood in Toronto, Canada, and he attended a public school that was frequented by Jewish kids. Drake had a difficult childhood financially, and because of that, he had a very small bar mitzvah, which is the coming of age party and celebration for Jewish boys. But of course, he grew up into a rich man, so he actually decided to have a re-bar mitzvah, and this one was a lot more grandiose. Drake proudly identifies himself as Canadian Jew. Next up on the list, we have Adam Levine, the front man of the pop band Maroon 5, Adam Levine, is also Jewish. Adam has been a judge on The Voice for several seasons, and he has produced some major hits with his band, as well as some pretty banging solo hits. Adam's paternal grandparents are Jewish, and so is his father. His mother is not a practicing Jew, and his family is not particularly religious. And Adam was given a choice to choose his religion by his dad freely. He has self-identified himself as Jewish in several interviews, even though he is not a very religious person himself. From there, we move on to an actor, Gabriel Match. The Suits star Gabriel Match, also known as Harvey Specter, that's the character he plays. If you're not familiar with that show, Suits, highly recommend it. Well, he is 100% Jewish. Gabriel's parents are Jewish, and his grandfather was born in Ukraine, and his grandmother was born in Russia. His grandparents from the other side were born in the United States and raised as European Jews. Gabriel was also surprisingly brought up as Jewish and was born in the Bronx, New York. His father even was a Jewish chaplain. Number seven leads us to Emmanuel Lubezki, the famous cinematographer Emmanuel Lubezki, who won three Oscars and BAFTA awards for the movies Gravity, Birdman, as well as The Revenant, is also very Jewish. Emmanuel is a director of photography and is famous for using natural light and making long, uncut takes. Emmanuel's paternal grandparents are Jewish and one of them was from Russia and the other was from Lithuania and both of them migrated to Mexico separately before they met and got married. Now Emmanuel's dad Mooney is also born in Mexico and he married a fellow Mexican born Jew economist Raquel Morgenstern. Emmanuel took the faith of his parents and was born and raised in Mexico as Jewish from all sides. The celebrity coming in in the number six spot is Charlie Puth. All right, guys, you probably know him because of his mega hit song, See You Again. He sang it with Wiz Khalifa, which has more than 5 billion views on YouTube at the time of filming this video. Also, he has another song, very popular, We Don't Talk Anymore. I think that one has over 2 billion views right now. Either way, yes, he's a very successful musician, but he grew up with a Jewish mom and a Catholic dad. He attended a Catholic school, and in one interview, he referred to his mother as my Jewish mother. Although he acknowledges his Jewish background, he isn't a practicing Jew. From there, we move on to number five, and this celebrity is the famous actor Daniel Day-Lewis. He is perhaps one of the best actors in the world, and he's won three Oscars. Daniel Day-Lewis, he comes from a very creative family. His dad, Cecil Day-Lewis, was a poet and the son of an Anglican minister, and his mother was a Jewish actress. But Daniel didn't really have a very religious upbringing. Bringing. He married Rebecca, who had a similar background as him, and who was half Jewish. The couple now lives in Ireland and has two children. According to Rebecca, the kids are not being raised in any faith. From there, let's talk about Timothy Chalamet. 
Timothy Chalamet from Little Women as well as Dune. He's also Jewish. Timothy has a Jewish mom and a European dad. Timothy was raised in New York in the United States and celebrating Jewish holidays was a very common thing in his household. He spent his summers over in France visiting his Protestant grandparents though. When he was 22 years old, he was nominated for an Oscar for the film Call Me By Your Name. Now the actor is half Russian Jewish and half Austrian Jewish descent. Number three brings us Lily Collins. She is also known as Emily from Emily in Paris. We all know that TV show on Netflix. Either way, she's also Jewish. Lily was born in England and was raised in the United States. Now her Jewishness comes from her maternal grandfather. Lily does not talk about her religion or political affiliations though. So there is no telling if she actually had a very Jewish upbringing or not. But either way, she is definitely part Jewish from her maternal side. Now coming in at number two, we have the English soccer player David Beckham. David actually identifies as half Jewish. David was very close to his maternal grandfather, Joseph, who was Jewish and considered him an example of a man to look up to. His grandmother was from America, but according to one of David Beckham's interviews, both his maternal grandparents were Jewish. When we read his autobiography, he wrote this, and I quote, I probably had more contact with Judaism than with any other religion. Now, in another interview, he mentioned that he received love from the Jewish community, all because he was half Jewish himself. He also sometimes wears a necklace with the Star of David, which of course we all know is a very Jewish symbol. Now, coming in at number one, here we have Bruno Mars. Bruno Mars is a very talented musician and his real name is Peter Hernandez and his parents belong to various different ethnicities. This guy is like a real mix of ethnicities. His mother who was native Filipino, Spanish and of Chinese blood was a Jew of Hungarian Ukrainian descent while his father who was born in New York was of Puerto Rican descent. Yeah, that's a lot. Bruno's dad identified himself as Jewish, which makes Bruno Mars Jewish too. But he doesn't talk much about that side of his ancestry, but he has stated that he does have some Jewish heritage. And he also might have been hinting at this with one of his albums that was untitled Unorthodox Jukebox. So there you have it guys. This was a look at 10 celebrities who are surprisingly Jewish. If you know any more celebrities who should have been on this list, feel free to comment them down below. Maybe. I'll do a part two. Either way, I hope you guys enjoyed this one. If you did, don't forget to leave a big thumbs up. And also, if this is your first time here to FTD Facts, subscribe and ring the bell. We post videos daily and I don't want you to miss any of them. Thanks for hanging out with me in this one and I'll catch you in the next episode.